The opioid crisis in Tennessee has state lawmakers and people in the prescription drug industry taking notice. Abuse of the painkillers has been called a disaster by Governor Haslam. His $30 million program to fight the problem has been approved by the House and Senate. Dr. Michael Mutter is a state expert on opioids. At a Wednesday conference on the opioid crisis at Union University, he said young people are habitual abusers. They probably send them to war if they can outrun a bullet. And uh, this age group will experiment. And so this is the group of patients that's had a huge increase in carfentanil, fentanyl, and heroin. Abuse of opioids is considered to be a multi-billion dollar problem. In addition to medical treatment, that includes lost wages, court costs, and even investigations by family and children's services. Dr. Mutter outlined just how serious the problem is. We're seeing instead of 80% of the people who are on heroin start with prescription drugs, which was a data set three or four years ago. We don't know the number today. In the end, Mutter and other experts at the conference said cleaning up the opioid mess is a problem that takes entire communities to work together. He said we can't just say it's bad and then put it on the shelf. Terry Jelks reporting for Jackson 24-7.